you have a blog which has two parts. One is called Literary Saloon, the other is Complete Review, but I think of them as one integrated entity. You review mm. books on a very regular basis, mm. and most of all, you review books which are being translated from other languages into English. Is that a fair way to put yes, it? Yes, foreign fiction dominates, yes. yes. And wha why the appeal of foreign language fiction to you? What what catches you there? Well, in part, it, it also uh, came about um, the site. I started the site in 1999. It's been yeah. around a long time. And one of um, the reasons I started it uh, was because I saw how many people were posting book reviews online. And suddenly, you had the possibility of getting book reviews not just from your local paper or from the national magazines, but from anywhere in the world. Uh, and one of the things that struck me, and this is also partly has to do with the timing in American publishing and in American book reviewing, is that there was very little coverage of especially translated fiction, uh, which would be much more popular, say, in the 1970s. Uh, uh, yeah. And suddenly, we, we had reached a real low point. And so uh, I made a conscious effort also to move in the, that direction. Uh, but aside from that, I also I find foreign fiction uh, more interesting in a way. It's, it's not that I find foreign fiction more interesting than American or British fiction, uh, but just I think it's better to, to read from everywhere, from all over the place, uh, rather than one specific locale. And uh, well, What's your theory of, um, of America? Where have we gone wrong? So you say correctly there was more interest in foreign fiction in the 1970s, right? Uh, we've moved away from that. Why has that happened? What's the institutional failure behind that? You could say lack of someone like you may be part of it, but you, you're here now. It's still the case. A novel comes out in American English, and they try to hide the fact that it was translated quite often. I'm right. sure you've seen this, or maybe not seen it. Right. Uh, well, I, thi I think actually things have improved a lot in the time I've been running the site. Uh, I think a major reason was that uh, there was a generational shift from the, especially the publishing world, the publishers who had come across uh, from Europe uh, around uh, World War II, and who obviously had brought a lot of international fiction, who were aware of what was being written elsewhere in the world, mainly in Europe, unfortunately, so relatively localized as well, but still. Um, and, but you also had it with the interest in Japanese fiction, for example. There was that generation, uh, which is also very much due to the sudden interest in Japan from World War II, uh, the people who learned Japanese, and then began translating the work. Uh, and I think there was a generational shift which played itself out most fully in the 1990s. Um, but uh, uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure why exactly it uh, went as uh, far down as it did.